everyone, it's Melissa. Today, I started out, well, I started out this morning. I have filmed this over and over again. I just could not get, I just couldn't get it to do right. So this is my last time filming it. It's, uh, it's, la it's later on, so we'll see how it goes. I hope it turned out okay. I'm not doing it again. But uh, today, I uh, filmed this look of my hair. Now, it started out really, really frizzy. And so um, I had talked to several people on Instagram about we wanted to have beachy waves, but when you've got curly, frizzy hair, it is hard, especially really frizzy hair, it is hard to get beachy waves because you've got the frizz going and you put the curling iron in or the wand to make the beachy wave. Well, the, the frizz is still there inside the curl. So when you go to separate it or do shake it out or anything the frizz just comes right back and the frizz takes over and you've just got a frizz ball all over so what i did was uh i wanted to straighten it and give it a bend at the same time so i i bought this curling iron or this flat iron from hot tools uh no hot shots i'm sorry from sally's and i think it's about three inches wide and it shows every little print that you've got so excuse that but um, what, I, what I did with this, I started out with real frizzy hair, which I'll show you. And I took it, now it's not on, but let me show you what I did. I'll just take a little piece, I'll take a little piece right here. Here's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you right here. So what I'm gonna do is, it's not on, so I can do it slowly. I start at the top and I start straightening it. As I'm straightening it, I do a full revolution grab the hair from underneath let me find it i usually had it sectioned off better so grab the hair right here and feed it through so it's straightening it and getting a bend at the same time well it didn't do it that way because it's not on but that gives you an idea of how it does so I did that very quickly all over my head. I didn't section it off very well at all, but it'll give you an idea of how I did it. Uh, I put some Color Wow on it to uh, get, some, get some of the frizz out and to add a little bit to the roots, I put some uh, Aveda Volumizing Tonic at the roots, all, both of those while it was dry and let both of those dry before I started doing the flat irons. Also, I wanted to mention, if you want to try a beachy wave look without using heat, then my friend Tammy, Tammy's Ageless Beauty, she did one where she used the belt from a bathrobe, which I just thought that was wonderful. Anyway, it turned out beautifully, and I'm gonna try that tonight, because I think that, that might work on my hair too. She wrapped it and worked it through, and, and it just made beautiful, beautiful curls and waves. So I'm going to link that video below so you can go look at it and uh, follow along with that if you want to because it's just a really good one. She's so pretty and she just has such beautiful hair too, but I can't wait to try that. So I did want to mention that in case you didn't want to try doing this with heat. But uh, on this one, I'm using heat to straighten it at the same time. So I'm going to show you how I did it. Okay, I have, uh, this is what my hair looks like naturally. I have had to I have to brush it out to get the tangles out uh, since I'm not wearing it curly. So uh, I have put Color Wow on it, and that has helped to straighten and get the frizz down a whole lot. Then I sprayed the roots with my volumizing tonic, so that'll help to get some you know height up here at the at the roots. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm just going to do a little bit. I'm not going to. I'm not gonna do it off a whole lot because I, I don't want this to be too long. I'm just gonna kind of do the sides all around and then just do the top. Okie dokie. So it's already sprayed and dried. So this is how, how it's done. You take your, your flat iron, yeah, it's hot, and got fingerprints on it. Okay, you take your flat iron, flat iron. You start as close to the root as you can. Start pulling it and and turn it all the way around, grab it at the bottom, and pull it out. Okay, and then that gives you that beachy wave. I, since this is so big and wide, I can do it pretty fast. 
Okay, so I'm going to start here at the top, do a complete revolution, feed it through, and got a bitchy wave. I'm going to go to this side, complete revolution, grab it, and feed it through. Complete revolution, feed it through. Okay, I'm gonna do the front, the top in the front now. I think I might part it in the middle. <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting on YouTube with with all this. <laughs> oh lousy. See if I can get my bangs kind of straight. We'll go after the go with the front pieces a little bit faster just to kind of give them a you know just a very slight little something. A little something something. <laughs> Have very much height up here. Let me try to do these two again, just straight back, and see if I can get a little, little something, something going. Up there. I keep saying a little, keep saying a little something, something. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can do. They gave it some light, didn't it? <laughs> let me let that cool. And then maybe I can smooth it down. Okay, let's do these bangs now. My neck is so red. <laughs> I've gotten all nervous. My neck gets red when I get nervous or get hot. I'm hot and I got nervous. I kind of want my bangs. Let me, let me see what I can do. They're so crazy. Okay, now I'm gonna let this cool. You know, you can spray it right now. I'm gonna let it cool and then probably then spray it. And kind of, I'm gonna take my fingers real wide, just rub it like I'm washing my hair, kind of, you know, rub it through the, the roots and then separate these pieces right here and see what we come with, uh, come back with. I'm gonna keep this plugged in 
in case I need to touch up some areas. So I'll be right back in a few minutes. So this is the finished look and I did, I filmed this later uh, and I demonstrated it dry so it kind of messed up my hair a little bit. But this is the finished look. You can kind of get an idea of what it looks like. I think I'm gonna keep this one. I filmed it again, uh, so my hair can't take much more of it, I don't think so. This one will have to do. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Be sure and watch Tammy's video where she does it with the bathrobe uh, belt. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a really good rest of the week and stay safe. And I'll talk to you soon. And thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.